Remember, this is Baltimore, our turf. In Baltimore, nobody delivers like we do. Are you ready? Okay, let's go! Frank Parsons, the preferred office supplies and paper partner of the Baltimore Ravens. Frank Parsons, everything your business needs delivered. It's called a bull rush. A football defender explodes forward, ready to obliterate anyone standing between him and the ball carrier. He's like a human battering ram. Which got us thinking, is he really like a battering ram? Does an NFL linebacker's bull rush pack as much force as an actual battering ram? To answer that question, we loaded up our science hardware and headed to the outdoor testing facility. And we recruited one of the best defensive players of all time, all-pro NFL linebacker Ray Lewis. Lewis is simply one of the most dominant players in the game. He loves to obliterate opponents with the bull rush. A bull rush is taking a man's will and saying, I can deal with you any way I feel like dealing with you. I'm going to put my helmet right up under your chin. I'm going to put my hands right up under your shoulder pads. And I'm going to push you as hard as I can to make sure I can get you out of the way. So I've already made up in my mind that anything's in front of me, I'm destroying it. That's when football and science comes together for real. For this test, Ray Lewis is going up against an all-star in his own field. Veteran SWAT team leader, Lee Waddell. This law enforcement tough guy has tracked down and apprehended thousands of dangerous criminals. Ray and Lee will each take on the same unforgiving opponent, a solid wooden door. This is a standard front door, two inches thick, and we've added extra bracing, heavy screws, and a chain lock to make sure the door provides maximum resistance. This door is not some prop door. This is a regular front door, like the door on your house. I mean, it's on there. I mean, it's solid. And our scientists have attached a load cell to the door. This high-tech sensor will record exactly how many pounds of force our linebacker and our SWAT officer deliver when they come a-knockin'. So what do you have that you're gonna use to get through the door? What we're gonna use is we have a 15-pound battering ram here, pretty standard. We use this to breach a lot of doors. This is what we go through all the time. And we're gonna see who wins, the battering ram or the bull rush. Let's do it. All right. Good impact, see where it hit right on the sensor. So that'll give us some really good numbers. So how much force did the battering ram generate? The load cell reveals it smashed the door with 800 pounds of force. That's like butting heads with a real ram. From only two feet away, the 15-pound ram accelerates rapidly up to almost 20 miles an hour. And all of that energy is focused on the small three-inch end. Since an NFL player can't move that fast and can't deliver a hit with such a concentrated contact area, football's bull rush shouldn't be able to generate as much force as this battering ram. But if anyone's up to the challenge, it's Ray Lewis. 
So what we've done is we've rigged up a door with a pressure plate in it to see exactly how much force you apply when you're bull rushing the line. If you look at this, I mean, this is a real door. I mean, you got to really hit this thing. All right. Let's do it. Let's do it, man. Science All right. meets Ray Lewis. <laughs> Getting through a door this solid is no joke. If Ray hits the door wrong, the energy he creates will reflect right back at him. Sports science, open up. Here we go. Is this for real? Three, two, one, go! Oh my God, look at the door. Yeah? Look at the door. You know, you don't realize until you look at it yourself, man. This door is shut. This is a real door. Ray didn't just break through the bolted knob and the chain lock. He ripped out over a dozen three-inch screws from the door frame. And completely sheared off all the hinges. This is freaking incredible, man. I'm gonna call my mom in a minute. <laughs> so how much force did Ray generate? Our motion capture technology gives us an inside look. The key equation here is force equals mass times acceleration. Ray weighs 15 times more than the battering ram. And by lowering his center of gravity one foot, and accelerating up to six Gs. Amazingly, Ray generates over 1,000 pounds of force. That's 200 more pounds of bone-crushing force than the battering ram. And the only reason Ray doesn't break bones every time he hits someone is because shoulder pads decrease the force by 50% and the rib cage is made to flex up to two and a half inches. But even with these factors, when you get hit by a Ray Lewis bull rush, it'll still feel like you're getting trampled by a real raging bull. That's how Ray Lewis uses physics to blow someone's doors off. Science meets Ray Lewis and Science loses again.